Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and I still have a messy desk. Um, forgive the shadows, I don't have the lighting situated in here just yet. Um, so there will be shadows, but we're working on it. So I was wanting to, I've done several haul videos over the course of the last few days. And so I really kind of wanted to do, I don't even know if I showed you guys this. Um, I did pick these up off of um, Timu. And so it says the Bible of Lilies and it's like vintage looking postcards. And so I kind of wanted to do a little something with this just to make them a little bit more vintage looking um, because I'd like to have these kind of on hand to put into some journals. Um, and I'm just trying to see if I have any ink up here that I can use because I still have a lot of my stuff down at the other house. I have no idea what color this is. Um, let's just take a look and see if this will work. I think it will. So I am just going to ink this up. So how is everybody doing? I hope everybody is doing well. I am doing wonderful, just crazy busy. Um, we are going to be back, um, you know, like I said, I'm filming in the original craft studio. Um, we have not got moved back in up here just yet, um, but we will be back in here the end of June at the latest, but I am really pushing to um, get back in here by like the middle of June. That's my goal. Um, I've already got the refrigerator and freezer stocked. I went and went to Sam's and done all of that today. Um, so I've got a lot of stuff done, but there's still, you know, a lot to do. And we have a lot of stuff at the other house that has to be moved. So what I was just, this is just a quick video just to show how easy it is to um, do some of this stuff. So like I said, I got these off of Timu, and I think it's maybe 30 or 50 of them. And in one of the last hauls, you know, I hauled some um, vintage-looking stamps. So I'm just going to pull a couple of these. And I'm just trying to see which ones I might want to use. Maybe some out of that pack. Um, yeah, I've and I've got another... Timu haul video that I need to do plus I have another order coming in my mom has another pretty large order coming in so there we've just been a little crazy with the Timu oh I'm throwing stuff so I'm just wanting to get one I don't necessarily need it to match but at the same time I don't want it to like clash so is that just one I'm guessing that it is so I'm actually going to ink this stamp up just a little bit and um, in one of my last haul videos if you watched it you saw um, I had got some um, an eyeshadow palette that was messed up when I got it well I contacted Timu and they refunded my money and then just told me to keep it so Timu is very good about that kind of stuff. All right, and then these are some stamps that I got from Timu. Um, I was trying to see if I had any kind of vintage script stamp here, but I don't. So let me show you what I'm gonna attempt to do. Let me pull this little, this is some pins I got off of Timu. So I am just going to like do some faux writing. So I'm gonna write, um, So I'm just scribbling something out. And so it doesn't have to be anything that can be read. Um, but the way that I've done it, it, you know, kind of looks a little more vintagey. 
And so this would just look really cute stuck down in a journal. So let's just maybe do a couple more. I'd love to have some of these just kind of setting to the side because um, I do have a couple of journals that as soon as I get back up here, um, I need to finish the one um, where I use the paper bag. Um, I need to finish that one up. Oh, I also got this little corner chomper thing off of Timu. And I got those ink pens off of Timu, guys. I'm going to have to delete the app because I have it really bad. Like, I love it. Alright, so let's just see what we can do. And I may just do several like this. Um, and actually, you could do these, like with these little postcards like this, we could do them in a mass make. So maybe that's what... Let, let me go ahead, since I've already started inking that, let me just go ahead and do that. And then what I'll do is I'll corner chomp several of them. Okay, <clears throat> let me set this to the side for just a minute. And so let me just get a couple of them and just go ahead. And you don't have to corner chomp them. I just kind of, I like the way it looks. So that's why I'm doing it. Um, but I want to go ahead because I want to ink all at one time do the stamps all at one time so that's what I like to do when I do like a mass make and because I do want these to be put a bunch of them so that I can have them just sitting there right ready to go so we're going to do several of them real quick let's see that'll be five so that'll be enough for now that'll give you guys the idea All right, and we're going to slide those out of the way. And let's go ahead and pick out our stamps that we want to use. Um, okay, that one will be good. I think this one will be good. That one. I'm going to use that one. Let's use... It's a rose, but it's okay. And one more. Maybe that one. One, two, three, four, five. That way we can do all of the inking at one time. All right, so now I'm just going to ink these stamps up a little bit. Again, it's not necessary, but it's just something I like to do. And so um, whenever I'm doing a mass make, I like to do all of the same steps um, all together. So I'll just, like if I was um, just sitting here doing these without, you know, doing a video, I'd probably go ahead and corner chomp that whole stack of postcards and then just do them all at one time. But for the sake of time of this video, we're not going to do that tonight. Well, it's night when I'm filming this. I don't know when this is going to post because there is a large Timu haul that's trying to upload right now. But that joker was like an hour long because, guys, it was huge. But I have missed doing my crafts. And so I wanted to just jump on here and do something really quick because I'm actually at my house. I'm waiting for my husband to get off before we go back out to um, the little place that we're living at. I actually come up here today when I got off, well, when I got off work, um, I went to Sam's and just spent a fortune. But I, because, you know, we haven't been here in a year. So I had cleaned everything out of the pantries, the refrigerator and freezer and all that. And so I just needed to restock on everything. And uh, so when I took off work today, I went by Sam's and just restocked on everything. And um, so I put a roast in the crock pot or in the pressure cooker actually. And I had bought a bunch of like hammer because I buy stuff in bulk, even though I don't have kids at home, you know, other than I have two teenage sons that are, but they're rarely home because they're always doing stuff. Um, 
but I still buy stuff in bulk and then I just separate it out into um, Ziploc bags and put it in the freezer and so that's what I was doing this afternoon I had bought hamburger meat and a whole pork loin and roast and that kind of stuff so I've done all that uh, let me see if it's still recording hopefully it is it's telling me that there's low power so this video is going to be very short so hopefully it did not like die on me completely so we're going to just finish this up really quick and call it a day but yeah so i done all of that and i'm just kind of waiting now for my husband to get off work um because I think he's going to come by here and eat dinner. And then we'll go out to the house where we're staying. Um, I guess it's okay to cover that up for now. I mean, that's really cute not covered. But we'll go ahead and just put it where it goes and deal with it like that. But, you know, a lot of times they had them crooked. So I'm trying to remember to do that. You know, you get a postcard, and the stamp is not always where it's supposed to be. So I need to remember that and not try to put it on there perfectly. So, ah, uh, don't do it. Oh, that was so close, guys. So close. All right, one more stamp. And we'll put it that like that. And let's see, is there anything on here? These could look like little stamp things. I don't know what they really are. But you know what? We're going to say that there are some kind of little stamp things. So let's just open these up. Oh, and this says airmail. Look at here. Look at here. Look at here, guys. We found something that we can use if I can figure out how to get into the bag. Be smarter than the bag, Betty Winfrey. Smarter than the bag, girlfriend. Okay. This is how you get smarter than the bag. You cut it open. See? Smarter than the bag. Alright, and so I don't have a stamp block right here, but that's okay. I do have this. And you guys, I'm sure, have seen me use the back of my stamp pads before whenever I don't have one available. That's what I do. Oh, that looks pretty cool. So let's go with a couple more. And it's okay that it's smeared and all that because, you know, it never does right anyway. And let's see, we could do this, it says airmail, just trying to get it on there the best way I can. And see, it don't even have to be very much on it because, you know, a lot of times it misses whenever it's going through the post office. And let's see, do we want to put anything else? Let's maybe put, let's just put something like this on it. Let's just see. How about this thing? That little hand thingamajigger. You know, a lot of times I'll put that saying, look, look. All right played around so much should I write anything on the maybe I'll write on a couple but I think these look good just like that honestly so let me just do Jill I want to thank you for your wonderful
wonderful gift. Much love. Ooh. See, it's not much to it, but it'll be okay. And then I think I'm not going to do anything on these. I think I'm just going to leave them like that. And I could even put like a little string on the top, make them into a tag bookmark. But how cute will these be to just drop down into a journal? And they're already done. I mean, all the work's pretty much done to begin with. So it's literally just inking it up a little bit. And that's it. Um, so yeah, guys, let me know what you think. I know, very quick video, um, but battery's dying and I just wanted to get a short junk journal video at least for you guys. I have missed doing them. But thank you all so much for watching and for all of your support, all of you that have been so supportive of me and everything that I do. Thank you guys. I appreciate you all so much. And I, I have not forgot about the giveaway. Um, I want to do that live and I just haven't went live. Um, so that will be coming up. The giveaway winner announcement will be coming up. Um, hopefully, I, I may try to go live Friday night. Um, I'm just not sure. But if I can go live Friday night, then we will do the giveaway winner live. So, all right, guys. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye, guys.